Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. So a whole bunch of haters said that I was going to have horrible heat soak because I switched my air filter and I don't have a heat shield and it's in the engine compartment. Well, this is the temperature from the mass airflow detector and the intake. And it says it is 70 degrees inside taking the air and sucking it into my car. And here, this is me talking what I needed in the shot. So then I pointed at the camera and it says 67 degrees outside. So it's only a three degree temperature difference. So I did not heat soak my engine and I'm getting 48 miles to the gallon at 64 miles per hour. And that was after driving for an hour and a half on I-5. Okay, so if you want to know what heat soak looks like, this is heat soak. This is my headers so hot they are brilliant red. This was on the BMW 8 Series that I used to drive about eight years ago. And I took it to Michigan International Speedway on a track day. And after driving for like half an hour at 150 miles an hour, that's what my engine looked like. So that's what heat soak looks like not what I had before. And this was really only a problem of the engine gets so hot things just plain stop working. Like I couldn't start the car afterwards because the alternator didn't work. 